I come out of my check. I didn't even know about this until somebody else told me. You got your curtains to slash last night. Yeah, that's all right, but now my problem is this pallet. Am I gonna make that? Oh. I think that's the most pallets I had in one trailer. Did you sign for you? I have to go back and sign for you, man. the way we have to start the day. I come out on my check, so I always stay, but I didn't even know about this until somebody else told me. So somebody else knocked on my door and went like, oh, all right, you got your curtains to slash last night. Didn't until like they managed to take anything, but they ripped the curtains. Look at that. There was another guy here. Well, they opened this, but they didn't manage to get it in though. I didn't got anything, but his curtain is slashed as well. This is the third time I've been robbed. A couple of weeks ago, it was the fuel, and now the curtains is getting out of control. This. Hello, can I help? Hiya, uh, I got a voucher code. It's 106058. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Set the traffic lights straight away and get to Anso. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna park up as soon as I get there. I'm gonna go and speak to someone and see if they got a trailer ready for me. Oh, they tipping this. All right, that's a trailer there. As you can tell, so, okay, they open. There's lots of space there and they clear the pallets, so that's good. You know what's gonna happen with this? Yeah, if you open up, we'll tip it. You gonna tip it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Awesome. All right. This is how sexy it looks when you strap it down properly. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to humble this. I just can't believe this amount of pilots are coming back from 250 miles away. Oh, I can't. Can. <laughs> well, you have this all the time. I can't also believe it. Alright, that's done. Alright, that's done. Look at that. Slash there, nice one. Done the same here, obviously and done that slashing there trying to get into the box obviously then i'm gonna get in all right everything been tipped so all i need to do now is just turn around and um, before i carry on going any further forward i go and do a little check should be all right go further forward and then come back in that and look that was shake again yeah that should be all right yeah that's all right but now my problem is this pallet <laughs> uh, am i gonna make that Oh, oh, it's close. That's close, but doable. All right. Yeah, that was all right there. Eh? Okay, yeah. We have to seat. Let's go back now. We have arrived now. Made it back, nine o'clock, as I predicted before. Dropped it straight as soon as we can and go and get the other one. And as you can see, it looks like they actually did fix the ground. Not as bad as it was. Okay, drop this one there and then go and pick the other one. All right, the one next to that. Not as close, but just a bit close. Look at that gap there. That is beautiful. Got a nice space there, both sides. I don't want to be hitting the back on that, do we? All right, all done. Just need to pull a bit forward. That's the one. Come on, a bit further. And then just drop it off. Yes. Back up. We're ready to go. Let's go and get out of the trailer now. Might give my truck a little clean really quickly. Um, be able to get them on the road again. All right, we're in the warehouse now. So we're getting loaded on that trailer. The other trailer is coming to this one. And that should be about it. So that one is getting into this one. It's, that is a long track. It's gonna take me at least half an hour to strap this low down now. I think that's the most pallets I had in one trailer. Damn it, I really can get to one of my straps. But well, guess what? Yeah, that's all right. Got it. Back in. Easy as that. Right. Oh, this curtains are massive curtains as well. Uh, that's how I strap down. All I need to do is just do my crisscross in here. So always a way to do stuff. I'll strap down, so one of them is missing. One of uh, this strap, so I'm just gonna take it off this one and put it in the front one. There you go, that's done it. You should strap it down now. And that is fully secure and legal. All we need is one more coming from the other side to this side to do the crisscross, so that should be all right. 
two straps there, but they haven't got the hooks ones. So I managed to get my hands on two of them. So I'm just gonna put it on now. All right, that's secure. They are dumb. That is a secure allows. I had an idea because I won't be able to get enough on this one. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hook this up. All right, that seems strong enough to me. And then what I can do now is reach all the way out here. With a little bit of imagination, you can do anything you want. That's a secure low there, no matter what you say. All right, that's fully secure, looks good. Play time, all I need to do is just... What's that for? I got it already. Oh, no, you just oh for this? Yeah, just told me to give you all that. All right. Here we go, Paul. The YouTube channel, you're gonna be on it now. You're proud of it. <laughs> Straight in. That's it, two poles. All right, let's get out of here now. Everything is done, all checks are done. We got fuel together and back. We have everything we need. So get there, drop this, see where we can get to. Um, let's, call it, let's call it a day. All right. All right, we're gonna arrive in B and Q now, and we're gonna get this tipped straight away as soon as we can. If you turn up any time before half an hour before when you're meant to be there, you risk. Uh, you will pay a fine or a fee of 500 pounds which it doesn't make sense to me to be honest because um, better be early than late i will say but they got their rules they know what they're doing anyway so strictly no parking prohibited it's got like signs every, everywhere ensure you have required pp and all that all that good stuff all right let's wait until we can get in and we can get this tipped all right we're going to door 20 i spoke to the guy there it was a little bit of wait in between but nothing nothing bad so I'll drop this massive load and get back to that pole in case uh, yes that's the one there i will say it's harder to park in line in between lanes than parking between trucks But you missed that. I'm gonna have to go forward, I think. Maybe not, maybe yeah, maybe I do, maybe don't. Oh no. Look at that. We nailed it. Bloody nailed that. <laughs> first one, like in between lays. This is the first time I actually get it done in, in a one. This is the first time I think I got actually in between lanes. We are, we are pulling forward. All right, we are the door on the paperwork and we be... Next time you will know, you yeah, have Yeah, you just doing your job, okay. that's about it. Anything else? No, nothing. All right, thank you. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe, like and comment. Cheers for everything, thank you.